All right, here we go, another video. <laughs> Good afternoon, ladies and gentle guardians. So today we have a video that I'm not gonna lie, it's gonna be a little bit of a little bit of a struggle for me because the weapon that we're gonna be using in the Crucible is an SMG. And that SMG, you guys obviously already know because you clicked on this video, that SMG is the Ikelos SMG, the V1.0.2, whatever the heck that means. Um, yeah, this is an SMG that I feel like, honestly, in terms of SMGs, like strictly SMGs in the Crucible, this is a good gun. Now, you can tell with my kill count, probably shouldn't have drawn attention to that because... Well, this is a um, fairly new weapon. Um, as you can tell, I barely used it in the Crucible. And to be honest, the last time I used an SMG in the Crucible was probably year one of Destiny 2. So it has been a long time. But I got this role and I really felt like it was worth addressing. Now, if I am being honest, I do quite think that this is the god rule. Not only did it come with dynamic sway reduction, it also came with tap the trigger and vorpal weapon. It also came with a stability masterwork, which I think for this gun specifically is essential because this thing does kind of kick. It's not terrible, but it does kind of kick. So stability masterwork definitely is very good. And then I still have a major spec on this. We're just gonna pop that on there. Hopefully that doesn't mess me up in the middle of the game. <laughs> Hopefully it doesn't mess me up in the middle of the game. Then we have Seraph Realms. This is an interesting pick and something that um, I heard from somebody else. I'm going to take their word for it because I trust them. But this perk specifically, I heard that Seraph Rounds increases range. So if that truly is the case, this is a crazy, crazy good perk for PvP because not only does it bounce off walls, you can honestly do a freaking hard light if you want to. If someone runs around the corner, you need to get them, try bouncing them off the wall. That might actually work and it increases the range. And then over here, um, I'm not really sure what the best barrel per se, po possibly polygonal would be my guess, It'd probably be one of the better barrels, but we got corkscrew rifling, which increases, slightly increases the range and the stability, but also slightly increases that handling speed. Then down here we got full bore, but there's no freaking way I'm doing full bore. And then we got flared magwell, which is fine. I mean, it increases the reload speed and the stability, but I feel like the boost and range that this gives is really good. It's also just a cool perk. And then honestly, for the mod, I have no freaking clue considering I forgot to put it on. So um, yeah, there you guys have it. That is the, can I fit this whole thing for my thumbnail without getting the, the, am I gonna cut this out of the video? I can't tell if it'll fit. Sorry about that. I'm um, trying to like have it not get in the way of my face cam. Anyway, yeah, that's the SMG. And all I can say is that this thing is going to be a struggle for me because I haven't used an SMG in forever in the Crucible. But what will be the thing to carry me? Should we wear a mask? Sure, we'll wear a mask. Why not? What will be the thing to carry me in this game? is gonna be this mountaintop because mountaintop with quick access access sling and this smg is actually very good like it's surprising mountaintop in general is just a busted gun so when you pair it with an smg or really anything else that fires quick uh it, it's gonna do some damage so hopefully mountaintop will carry me this game because oh my gosh i do not very i don't feel very confident but we're gonna we're gonna try it we're gonna do whatever but uh yeah that's all i got to say let's head right to the crucible. I'm gonna be honest, I don't think there are gonna be very good uh, SMG lanes whatsoever on this map, but I'll do my best. I'll do my best. Oh man, this is gonna be a struggle. I've, I played like four games with this thing. If like three or four. That's the most amount of SMG, uh, most amount I've played with an SMG since, like I said, <laughs> <laughs> like year one of Destiny 2, back when like, you guys remember, back when like Antiope was a thing. Wow, that was a good nade. I will give it to him, that was pretty good. Okay, I don't want to get blown up on my own trip mine, that would be very bad. Alright, alright, we're doing things. And I get Telesta, that is such a strange exotic, dude. You guys know Telesto, that's the gun that is constantly bugged and Bungie can never fix it and... Okay, I, I'm trying to get used to the... The counter battle. I'm dead. There's no way. I'm just dead. I, I'm not getting out of this. Nope. 
Like, see, the problem with SMGs, man, the problem with SMGs is that auto rifles can do what they can do, except way better. Like, I mean way better. Alright, I'll take the assist. Like, cause they kill just as fast or faster, and from any range. So, I mean... Dude, SMGs definitely need to be reworked. Definitely. Um... Oh, I tried a 2000 IQ that... Guess not. That's okay. Oh, okay. Well, I wasn't even aiming for that other guy, but if it works, it works. I mean, we'll take it. Actually, Catamounts really helps this thing. I definitely like it, because this thing was a little bit hard to manage before. So, I mean, y you could probably notice, but I'm still kind of trying to get used to it. But it does... It does help it. Oh, I hate it when I don't know where literally anything is. Oh, there's the range at play right there. You can tell, dude. You can tell the range is definitely doing something right there. Yes! Alright. I'm trying to focus on using the SMG and not using the mountaintop. Because <laughs> we all know about the mountaintop. This video isn't about that. <laughs> Someone push, actually. I would appreciate Thank you. Dang it. Of course, he's going to go straight back with his celestial fi- I'm dead. I try- I pull it out, and I try firing, and it just doesn't fire. Nope. Nope, 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 nope. I was actually kind of scared, but we're good. We're good. Just gotta breathe, Michael. Just breathe. You will probably notice I'm actually using six shot. Wow. That's crazy, I know. Six shot and not, um, oh! See, we got a pretty cheeky kill right there. Six shot and not golden, I mean, three shot. Which is surprising for me, actually. Speaking of that, dude, they should actually bring back Acleophage Symbiote. I mean, eh. Eh, they could probably come up with something else as a good substitute. I don't think they have to bring it back, but I do think it would be cool. Ow, I can't see. Oh, that was garbage! Please don't shoot that! I'll take it. I had no clue what was going on. Like, I, if I can take a melee kill, I'll take it. Because I genuinely had no clue what was going on. Oh! <laughs> this should be interesting for the SMG. I think it'll be okay. Now, I'm going to be honest with you. This is terrible self-confidence, but I don't think this is going to go well whatsoever. <laughs> I do not think it's going to go well, dude. Oh, Eve. And if it does, maybe the mountaintop's gonna carry me. And it's a shame because this is a really good, really good gun. It is. And this is the god roll, and I'm confident in saying that, but. But it's just where SMGs are right now is the problem. I don't have a same step. Perhaps this is not going completely ideal. Please tell me you guys saw that. Like, I'm not going crazy. Apparently, uh, that sword's, like, slashy slash can just blow up my mountaintop and then do zero damage to the receiver. Because that's apparently a thing that that can do now. Okay, no, 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 no. I have been, no, 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 I have been receiving way too much jank this and last game. Like, no, no, I'm sorry, bro. It just crosses the line right there. That's ridiculous. Like, that is just, I mean, maybe he had an overshield and I just didn't see because he was up in my face. But, like, even then, man, that is just absolutely absurd. I mean,. I told you guys so, I was not feeling good going into this game at all, but, um, he has a shotgun, I'm just dead, I'm, and this guy just stole both of us. It's very sad and unfortunate, right? Cause like I want, I want this to be viable, but like, 
it just gets outclassed by so many other things, right? It's getting outclassed by SMGs. What am I saying? It's getting outclassed by... It's... I don't have it loaded. By sidearms. It gets outclassed by slug shotties. Like, it's just... Okay, yep, yep, sure! Woo! Yeah, nice. I'm salty this game, if you cannot tell. <laughs> like, this is absurd, dude. Like, and it's, I mean, yeah, it's on me, because, like, I'm just not used to using the gun, period. But, uh... But, yeah, I don't know. It's a little sad. I wish I could, you know, really show you guys this gun, but it's just unfortunate that it just isn't... I don't know. It's just not putting in the work that I had hoped. I mean, it's good, but like I said, like, a thousand times already, it's an SMG, right? Like, that's his downfall. The fact that it is an SMG is this gun's downfall, which is, it's sad, dude. Like, it's really sad, and I didn't even use this all game. Hopefully, that gives you a decent idea of how the gun functions. It's fine. It, it you can tell I'm, like, salt now, but I, I gotta stay optimistic. Um... Yeah, I don't know. I have a lot of mixed feelings about it. Because it's unfortunate, because I got this role, and I'm like, this is the PvP god role. And I am confident about that. That this is the god role for PvP. Um, no questions about that. It's just... The meta's changed a lot. This isn't year one anymore. And Antiope isn't on top. Um, now, if I played around with this a little bit more, if I knew how to use an SMG a little bit more, would have it... You know, would have I had some more success? Yeah, probably. Probably would have. But just in general, um, let's say you take a player that's used to using equally SMGs and sidearms just as much. Um, let's say theoretically from an equal standpoint. When you give him the sidearm, he's just flat out going to do better with it. Just because sidearms are just, they're better. They kill at the same ranges and they kill faster. There's no point, absolutely no point in using an IQ, just an SMG period, when there are things like gnawing hunger in the game. When they kill, I don't know the TTK of this gun, but gnawing hunger is like 0.7 or something like that. And it kills at way farther ranges and is way more accurate. Like there's just, I hate to say it, but I'm, this is one of those times where like, I'm being blatantly honest, like I, with all the other guns out there, like if if you like SMGs, if you want to use an SMG, if you want a good, solid option when it comes to using SMGs and you like them, yes, use this gun. But if you want to be, like I said, you can be moderately successful with this if you know how to use it. I obviously don't because I only use SMGs. This one specifically in PVE, um, but you can be moderately successful, but honestly, you'll be hurting yourself. You will be handicapping yourself if you go and use an SMG just because there are so many other better options. Like, it's ridiculous. And it's not this gun's fault. It's a great, great gun. It's an amazing option. But the fact that there are other guns like Gnawing Hunger and Sidearms and Slug Shotguns like Shappy just put this thing to shame. And it's unfortunate, but... Sorry, I hope I wasn't too quiet. And, like, it's unfortunate, but it's just the truth. So if you want a good SMG, and this thing's got an amazing PvE role and an amazing PvP role, as you can see. So if you want a good SMG, please get it. It's great. If you like using SMGs in the Crucible, you do you. But I'm saying optimally from a meta standpoint, SMGs are just falling behind. And I do think they need a buff. Not too much of a buff, or else the, this thing would be pretty busted. But it, they do need a buff, just in general. Um, because they are falling behind. This is like Destiny 1, Year 1 meta here. Alright, it's two years behind. It, it needs some attention. I think it's time, Bunga. But that's my thoughts on the gun. Um, yeah, I know. I got kind of salt in that recording. But, um, hopefully it was a decent representation of how this gun is. Also, the fact that I put a counterbalance on and I did not know how it was going to feel beforehand probably didn't help me, but that's okay. I'll stop making excuses. Other than that, also, hip hip freaking hooray. The webcam didn't freeze the entire video. That's the second video in a row. It hasn't done that to me, and that makes me really happy. So, there you guys have it. That is the Aikilos underscore SMG underscore V1.0.2 SMG. Um, it's cool. 
I mean, I recommend it, I guess. But, uh, hope you guys have an amazing rest of your day. Remember to stay as positive as possible. <sighs> and I'll see you guys in the next video.